Hi, this three minute video gives you a brief overview of how BrightPay helps you with your auto enrolment duties. I hope that you find it informative and that any fears you have are dispelled. With BrightPay, auto enrolment is easy. You will know your staging date when you receive your letter from the pension regulator or by looking it up on the pension regulator website. Entering your staging date in BrightPay will ensure that on-screen alerts kick in when they should. Setting up your auto-enrolment scheme in BrightPay is easy and should be done well before your staging date. BrightPay is fully compatible with many different pension providers, including Nest, Now Pensions, The People's Pension and Scottish Widows. In this example, we are using Nest as our scheme. And if you have entered your details on the Nest portal, you will be familiar with the questions being asked in BrightPay. In most cases, all you need to enter are the employer reference, the group name and the payment source. All of these must be entered the exact same way as you entered on the Nest portal, so there won't be any problems when you submit enrolment or contribution files to Nest. There are various places in BrightPay where you will receive on-screen alerts for auto-enrolment. For example, when processing employees pay in a period where an auto-enrolment action is required. The alert will link you directly to the relevant action. Assuming you already have an auto-enrolment scheme set up, enrolling an employee is really straightforward in BrightPay. In this example, we are not using postponement, so we are enrolling the employee. After clicking Enroll, simply select the scheme you are enrolling them into, in this case Nest, and then confirm your selection. The employee has now been enrolled and BrightPay will make the appropriate pension deductions thereafter. You must now write to or email the employee with statutory information, including their right to opt out. This is all catered for within BrightPay. Physically enrolling an employee into your auto-enrolment scheme is done either by uploading an electronic file on the pension provider's website or by manually inputting the information. BrightPay will prepare the Nest enrolment file for you. Before finalising a pay period, you will see that all enrolled employees have pension deductions and employer contributions included. When we finalise the pay slips for a pay period and look at the actual pay slips, again we will see that pension deductions and employer contributions are included, as is required under auto-enrolment legislation. A new task for the employer after each pay period is the preparation and submission of contribution details to the auto-enrolment provider. Effectively, this slots alongside RTI as just one more thing to do each pay period and BrightPay makes it all seem effortless. Eligible job holders are enrolled by you whether they like it or not. However, after being enrolled, they can opt out. Within the opt-out period, they must give you an opt-out notice, which they will have received from the pension company. BrightPay will then refund all deductions already made and show this refund on the payslip. After all your staging duties have been performed, it is important in each subsequent pay period to continue monitoring staff who were not already enrolled, for example an employee turning 22 years of age. BrightPay will alert you to such events and prompt you to perform the necessary action, be it enrol or postpone.